What is monological thinking and what is multilogical thinking? Monological thinking, uh, also known as one uh, dimensional thinking, is a thinking process that is conducted uh, exclusively uh, within a viewpoint of analysis and framework of reference. Um, a simple example of monological thinking is the process of uh, thinking that takes place within the range of uh, belief systems or uh, out of a self-belief. For instance, a self-belief about being right about something uh, and having no willingness uh, at all uh, to question the validity or invalidity of the premises behind the such self-belief. A complex example instead of uh, monological thinking can be represented by a series of complex intellectual speculations uh, about the existence of God, for example, uh, undertaken out of the assumption or belief that God does exist uh, uh, in a way or another, like theology, for example. Monological thinking usually is what takes place when we have a self-belief or a collective accepted belief because we use it as a cognitive filter in order to pretentiously understand our emotions, our ideas, our viewpoints, our reference points, even our assumptions and our epistemic acceptances. Multilogical thinking instead, or also known as multidimensional thinking, is a thinking procedure that sympathetically enters, considers, and reasons properly things within and through multiple viewpoints and references as a framework of thinking and analysis. Multilogical thinking is also used in uh, the programming of uh, deep machine learning and AI development, which is a somehow a paradox because we are programming machines to think multilogically, while we are not doing the same with our own psychology and educational system. Multilogical thinking identifies the presence of a self-belief or a collective belief. It cancels that out and it tries to analyze the validity or invalidity of the premises about our emotions, about our ideas, about our viewpoints, about our reference points, about our assumptions and about our epistemic acceptances. So to understand and to find out objectively and logically what is correct in it and what has to be questioned.